heavyweight collision between Bruce Lee and Vulcan Uzdemir. All right, well, he's one of the more accomplished strikers in this division. Sprawl and brawl, whatever you want to say, he's going to try to keep this fight standing tonight. It does not matter how he accomplishes it. All he wants to do is be on his feet and at range, hitting you with the beautiful jab, staying away from the grappling exchanges. You don't accomplish all the things that this man has accomplished over the course of his career without understanding distance. He has great distance management, which then in turn allows him to land all these beautiful diverse kicks, spinning back kick, jumping high kick, so many things he possesses that he will try to use tonight in this fight. Yeah, if this turns into a kickboxing match tonight, most it's people over. believe, yeah, his opponent is in a it's world over, of trouble. Well, you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, champ. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven-foot Kareem Abdul-Jabbar <laughs> to stay undefeated. Right. If you could do that, you could do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee, in a nutshell. Just so wise. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. So these fighters relatively close in age, just a year apart. Some differences in height and reach as well. Here is Bruce Ladies Buffett. and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. <laughs> Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 17 wins, six losses. He stands six feet one is tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Freiburg, Switzerland, Vulcan No Time Ooze to me. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the right corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, Bruce the Dragon Lee. You've been given your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. They touch him up, and we are underway. Ready. You ready to fight? All right, let's get this one started here. Round one is underway. We've got a striker who is a force to be reckoned with. Tonight, though, he draws a guy who can do a little bit of everything. And that guy is usually the one that will have the advantage. But we know what a high-level striker is, and this guy is as high-level as we've ever seen in the UFC. A oh, little single-collar tie there. And there comes the separation now. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the attempt. Single collar tie now. Oh, combination of knees. That is not what he is looking for. He better raise that guard quickly. He better raise that guard or he's going to fall asleep. You cannot allow someone to knee you in the head. Nice strikes. Right hand upstairs. 
I mean, he's cutting them down the side with these beautiful leg kicks. Lee gets caught by that straight punch. His defense has abandoned him tonight. Big kick. So there it is, Tallo Fighter landing a knee to the body. Slips the shot. Nice combination of jabs there by Ustami. Block that kick to the body. Big ball punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. Just over three minutes now to go. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. He gets to his spot, the tie clinch. Then he starts to let the knees block. Effective punch there by Lee. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Just out of range with that left hook. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. Huge block there. Big head kick lands. Going back to his patented kicks here, but unable to find the target there. Stuffs the takedown, and he hip tosses him to the mat. Now we'll see what he can do from here, DC. Right into side control. He's going to try to control him, then find a submission. And he landed the right hand there. Close guard. Well, you gotta be working off of your back. He's certainly doing so here. Nice punch. Nice punch, man. Oh, beautiful strike there as he lands up top, and he does so right after catching the leg. So maybe you thought he would catch the leg and go for a takedown. Instead, he goes for the punch, and he certainly found the range on that one. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively protecting the head and sort of maybe letting his opponent gas out a little bit with all the volume. His opponent sees the target, but he can't get to the target. So he'll continue to throw, and he'll continue to wear on his own gas tank. Nice head kick. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one? So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh, single collar tie here. And they separate. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Hard shots landing on both sides here. Counter punches, good by Lee. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Effective punch there by Ustami. It's such a fast leg kick. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays, DC. And if you like the kicking game, that was the round for you. Yeah, man, he used his kicks beautifully. He managed distance, managed space, and eventually those kicks started to really take an effect on his opponent and slow him down. He has to stay the course next round. All right, we'll see how it goes here in this next round. A high number of kicks landed there in the previous round, and at some point, these are gonna really start to take their turn. They do start to take an effect whenever you're taking kick after kick after kick, and watching him fight with that knowledge and that patience Shows his fight IQ. Nice punch lands over the top. Single collar tie now. Oh! And he continues to work the body here. 
Uzdemir's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. All collar tie. And they separate. Ooh, blocks the shot. Leg kick. Hardy closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. That was it again. Nice, nice. Oh, and there is the kick. That one checked by Ustami. Beautiful leg kick thrown. Oh, spinning back. He didn't telegraph that one at all. Now he's got the Muay Thai plug. And they separate. Straight right hand now just misses. Big kick lands. And both guys really throwing with authority. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Trying to hammer that lead leg. Oh, he's got it going now. Nice connection there, DC. Another punch landed. And they separate. Got the single collar tie. Man, as he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two, definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. A little single collar tie there. Right hand upstairs. Missed with that attempt. Oh, and he caught the kick. All right, single collar tie now. And then he lands a nice elbow. Well, missed on that one. Stuffs that takedown attempt without issue. Oh, beautiful execution with the knee strike there. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. What do you follow up a beautiful strike like that knee with? You see very short. Well, he has certainly kept the punch counters busy tonight. He's landed a ton of significant strikes and clearly is winning this fight tonight. He's winning this fight going away, and it's one of those rare instances where everything comes together. Big punch lands through the middle. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Oh, beautiful jab by him there. Got that to the target quickly. He's dictating the fight with a jab. Oh, stuffs the takedown without issue. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Start to see some of the damage caught underneath that right eye. Again, going back to the jab just out of range. Lee gets caught with that punch. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. How about jab, jab, right hand? Right. Because eventually you're gonna have to put something on your opponent that's gonna really make him pause. I believe the jab is working so well, he drops a big right hand after it, he may be able to finish his fight. Big kick land. Drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Uzdemir gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. Beautiful body kick lands right under the elbow. Oh, single collar tie here. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. He loaded up on that right hand, too. He blocks the punch. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. All right, so an entertaining five minutes. Let's look back at some of the highlights, DC, and I'd imagine a lot of these replays are gonna be rooted in that kicking game that was on full display. Absolutely. You're gonna see a lot of different techniques, but the kicking was the key to him getting ahead in this fight. He's out ahead now. 
He needs to stay the course and continue to do that as the fight goes on. All right, DC, buckle up. Here we go with our next round. High number of kicks landed in the previous round, and he'll look to keep it going. He'll look to keep winning the fight with his kicks. He's throwing high kicks, leg kick, body kicks. He's even throwing a couple spin kicks in there. This guy is so educated with fighting with his legs. Nice connection with a the punch there. It's hard to recall a time in the past that his boxing looked this sharp. He never looked this good. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. You can't take many of those, you better check. Oh, good sequence there. The right hand followed by the left. Single collar tie now. Boy, tie plump. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. Oh, trying to turn out the lights with that roundhouse kick, but just misses. Oh, lands a stiff punch there. Nice connection. Oh, nice lands. ustamir has got the tie clinch now. They continue to exchange. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Now connects with a right. Nice head kick. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. Oh, nice connection there with a the punch, DC. Great time to land that punch. That was a thudding leg kick. Beautiful kick. Tie. Nice body kick. Hook shot attempt to the head here. Instead, it's blocked by Lee. Oh, he's landed a high number of total strikes here in the latter stages of this fight. He's really picked up the pace and landing far more strikes than he did in previous rounds. <laughs> Trying to get the knees going. Well, he's doing a nice job here blocking these shots. The chin is tucked, the hands are high. Pretty good job defensively thus far. Great job defensively. He's seeing everything coming. Well-placed kick there by Lee. Both fighters here continuing to try to get a more dominant position in the clinch, getting fatigued in the process, I would think. It's very taxing to be chest to chest, a position we call 50-50 because nobody has the advantage. Who's gonna be the one to find that one little area that they can expose to give them the slightest advantage. Nice head kick. Oh, the cut on that cheek is only getting worse. His face is a mess. Nice body kick right under the elbow. Caught that kick there. Oh, a nice punch out of the break there after he had caught the leg. So he is really starting to put it all together now and clearly seems to have found the timing of his opponent. Well, he has certainly found the range and staying pretty busy here on the feet. He's being busy, but it's also the timing and the accuracy that's allowing him to land so many attacks. Real sneaky head kick gets in there. And he lands that side kick. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. That strike blocked by Ustamir. Very tricky when he throws that body kick. of inches right there, Damn. boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Oh, he continues to land a high number of strikes in this round. Really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. Certainly have to be mindful that you don't gas out, but you gotta like the output on display here. Outstanding kick there by Lee. Takedown attempt late, and it's good. Oh, and he finally gets the takedown now. So what do they say? It, try, try again. 
if, if at first you don't succeed, you try, try again. And this guy is the poster boy for that saying, because he shot many takedown attempts, and he finally has secured one. high-level highlights from that last round, DC. Take us through the replay. If he fought like this, I would be comfortable entering him into a K-1-level right. kickboxing competition. He's that good at finding and landing those kicks at will. He needs to continue to do this as the fight goes on. All right, here we go as our next round gets Good underway. Fight. His strong leg packs so much power that even when he doesn't throw it full throttle, you see he's able to inflict damage. We'll see if he can keep it going here in this He round. doesn't throw it full power, but even when he faints it, he draws out reactions from his opponents because they don't want to get hit with any more of those kicks. It's a sight to behold. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. It's a good right hand right there. Uzdemir's cut on his cheek is nasty, leaky, leaky. That thing is leaking bad now. Oh, yeah! Well, eventually, you know he's going to turn this defense into offense, but he's certainly doing a nice job on the defensive end. Of they talk about the feeling out process. He's getting his opponent's timing. Now he's blocking everything. Expect counters as we go forward. Oh, a nice straight punch there to his opponent, and he lands it just after catching the leg. So clearly, he is starting to find his timing, not just offensively, but defensively as well. Very good read there. Nice stupid punch. Just a slip there. Right on the button. Oh! He's out! It's over! It's over! <laughs> yeah, that was just a gorgeous shot to end the fight right there. I'm not even sure the opponent really saw it coming, so back to the drawing board for him. But for the winner, this is certainly exactly what he was looking for here tonight. Well, another highlight for the real DC as we look back at that scintillating knockout. Yeah, but the whole fight, he was landing great strikes, kicks, punches. He was doing everything right until eventually he found the shot that ended the fight. And there he is after Ladies the huge gentlemen, knockout Davis turned Davis in Davis tonight. Davis Near Davis perfect Davis execution Davis Davis and one of the bigger highlights of his UFC career. Bruce, the Dragon Lee! Oh, well, there he is after a huge knockout win tonight. You going to the after party or what? I mean, I'm heading over there right now, John. <laughs> I'm asking the producers, how soon can I get up? Because it's going to be a party over there. Not only because of the knockout, but that extra bonus check he's going to be carrying to the club tonight.